Yes, Jerry, every time I come to, I see more and more improvement, brother. Oh, we, we I mean, you there, just. Bro. We're almost there. We, we're already you're using an inspiration it. for a whole we're generation. Already, we're already using the place, but, you know, we, of course, we're trying to finish it. And uh, y'all will get your chance to. So, what is this there. building really this about? This is the uh, uh, library and uh, multi purpose uh, complex, we call it. We're going to have put some names on it here soon when we finish it, uh, you know, in honor of some people. But now, this level is the library level. Uh, fortunately, we've had a sister who has contributed recently the tiles for this level and the level upstairs. Y'all can just step in real quick. Should stop? No. Yeah, if you can see all right in here. Yeah, this is our library. Yeah, this is our library. You know what I was saying before, uh, really our objective is to, for the students when they come through, to just get an exposure, just like we did now, a brief exposure. And once they're exposed, uh, then we have something to build on. Have something to build on. So we're building this library on this floor. And uh, as you can see, we've got a lot of windows. We got our tiles, we're in good shape. We got to do all of these ceilings. We still have uh, lots and lots of uh, plastering to do on the back side that you can't see. We got to take care of bathrooms. We got to get lights and fans. We got to still do a whole lot of work in the corridors going upstairs, the stairwell. And uh, there's, there's still a lot to do. We still have to go all the way back around and say nothing to paint. But anyway, we're getting there. The idea is this floor will be a library, mainly digital, because you know when they leave with books, you can't find them. Uh, you know, it's not like there we just get a kindly message in the mail here, you know, for where it's going. But we're going to digitize as much as possible so people can just plug in their pen drives, download the PDF, and go. And that's what we're going to do. We'll, we'll let the children start building their own books. Uh, this side mainly is the books and all of that. That side is also books, but we'll also have our computers and our printers and all the stuff mm -hmm. over, over in that area, too. So we got bathrooms on both sides. The next floor looks a lot like this, a little bit different than this. We got a stairwell that goes outside of here up to the next floor, but basically it looks about like this, tiles down, and that's where we do our actual classes, that's where we do our teaching, that's where we'll have our programs, we have community programs, and the idea with the young people, first project, take a person off the wall, Saturday morning, spend say two, three hours, you know, and just have those classes. So you see Khalid Arat there, I told you something quick. We're going to go into detail and then we'll have the students uh, do a lot of teaching because when the students do the teaching and you record it and send it out, other students just pay much more attention to it. So then whether you're in Brazil or, or in uh, Mar-a-Lago, I know some of y'all plan on Y'all can be watching African children teach the truth. Sister. You said you're going to put the um, items on PDFs that they can download here. Yes. Are you also going to make them accessible online so that those of us who are not oh well, all of that, all of the lessons and all of that stuff will be accessible online. PDF we'll talk about when the cameras go off. <laughs> so y'all got y'all got so much stuff. I mean, if I go to the mining now, he's got enough, and I got enough, and other people have enough. Yeah, we, really, to fill up about five libraries. I mean. Yeah. So much stuff is scanned. So much stuff is online. I mean, it's just incredible. So I. I mean, and Jerry, I, I got a collection of the old DVDs, and, and DHS that we used to have a collection. I, I still got that list. So all the DVD, a lot of that stuff, I, you know, he gave yeah, we, we, the we, actual we, version. So. And once this thing wasn't more yeah. in place, we're going, you know, we're yeah, gonna, so, you know, we're we gonna have, get it all set up. We have the material. Yeah, it's gonna be powerful. We just gotta make sure we got the access to the young people and the system for doing it. So uh, we're getting close. We're getting very close. So I just wanted to all to see. Uh, we started in 2019 on this, and then uh, then spent about four or five months, feel like crazy, you know. Spent out. And then that stuff then, happened. And then that thing came. The thing came, yeah. And then everything was quiet for a while, you know. 20, 20, 20, 20, 2021, kind of stand. 2022 started going again, and now we're. You know, we see the finish line, see the promise line. But we use it anyway, but I mean, we want to seriously use it. Right. And then, of course, as you see, we also use it for other things. You know, people are, our children are doing uh, dancing, they're doing drumming, you know, doing cultural programs. I think you all see more of them today. So, 
One other thing, Jerry, one other thing. Uh, do you have a rooftop access right now? Yeah, I do. Uh, can we just make a quick walk up to the rooftop? Whoever wants to walk to the rooftop. Yeah, it's this incredible view of Prom Prom. Yeah, some people like look up there and go, ah. And then for those, and then for those who the don't, video, uh, they yeah. can just get, you know, they can get ready okay, to. Okay, so you can start. Can look, if, if you don't feel like going up to the top, you can. Uh, yeah, you, you can, can uh, get yourself positioned for your lunch. All right, so the stairs is back here. All right. Uh, they ready or what? Uh, okay, y'all can start. But mind, start taking them up to the top. All right, family. And you can look in that second level there. I'm all right, so family, you're on a, you're, everyone, you're on a construction site, so I need to see hard hats and heavy, and, um, heavy boots. <laughs> Those are the laws of the construction site, family. Hard, uh, hard hats and, uh, and steel toe boots. But unfortunately... Unfortunately, we don't have those things with us today, because... Uh, but. The good thing is, most of the hard construction is done. Come on, family. Two more, two more flights. Two more flights. This is not what you said. So yes, family. This is Ningo and Prom Prom, and you're getting a nice aerial view of the whole neighborhood. When I first came here in 2008, family, half of what you see did not exist. Okay. Yes. You're going the wrong direction. <laughs> hey, love. You're in the, you're in the wrong direction. You're in the wrong direction. <laughs> Yeah, nice breeze, you get good breeze, and also you get a beautiful view of the, the extended town. You see how everybody compound look. So family, we are literally on the rooftop of the library here at the African Ancestral Wall here in Ningro. And it's uh, Ningo and not Prom Prom. Prom Prom is close by, but we usually say Ningo slash Prom Prom uh, for the general area. We got the water techniques going on. As a matter of fact, this is perfect elevation to be able to have a nice catch water system. Huh? And what you're looking at, family, yes, that is what we call the Atlantic Ocean. So you're, so, I, so family, as you can look across, that is the ocean right there. That's the same coastline we're gonna be driving along. Okay. Now, these are the communities that are being built. Uh, these are individual uh, compounds and homes. Okay. The community that's being built, um, we're gonna go to one uh, this afternoon on our way back out. It's called Stadium View. Okay. Yeah, these are these uh, people just build big homes and, and build Michigan. compound. You spend 20, 10, 20 years and you just build little by little. And. Yes, family. So, family, the journey continues.